Hello everyone and welcome to the new video. My name is Satan. Today we are gonna be checking the first game that I have ever purchased and well not played but at least the pur first game purchased on the Steam and the game is called The Basement Collection which is the collection of uh, I guess uh, I think seven to eight games of the game creator, uh, I already forgot his name, it was Edmund something, I think. Sorry, <laughs> sorry, I already forgot the name. Um, but yeah, it's just gonna be kind of me going through through this collection of games and kind of getting my impressions out of them. Uh, I have played this game when I bought it back in the day, I don't even remember, it was many, many, many years ago. But I have completely forgotten about this game and that even existed in my library. So that's why I'm gonna making this comeback to this game, at least for this one video and see what the games are all about. So yeah, without further ado, let's just jump into the gameplay itself. Alright, so here we are with the basement collection, the first game that I have most probably ever purchased in the Steam, if my memory serves me right. At least it, it's, it has to be the first one that I actually used my own money to buy, buy at Steam Library. I'm not even sure why I have bought this game. Maybe I thought as a kid that it's a good value to get many games in one package, so that would be the reason why I ever decided to buy this game. I really can't tell. But we're gonna check it out, because uh, I just wanted to see I don't really remember much anything about this game, so I just kind of want to go and see what was this game that I decided to buy back all those years ago. And as usual, I'm going to do a real quick audio check, so just a second. Oh, Alright, so everything seems to be in order, order with the, with the uh, recording itself, so uh, we're going to start to check off the situation. It looks like that I actually even don't have everything unlocked here but let's start with the uh, first game which is the Meat Boy the original flash prototype so I think many of you know the Super Meat Boy game and this is just kind of uh, the prototype version of that game so we're just gonna open it up and and yeah as you can see the new Crunch logo and such I, I think this has been originally released in the way back Back in the day, in the, like, the Newgrounds website. And yeah, it, just, it seems to be a really kind of a, this prototype the version as it says. And as you can see, I, play, I have played it a little bit, I think, back in the day. I've also beaten the Super Meat Boy, Boy itself, so it's actually nothing too much new to me. Let's just check out a little bit what kind of this original Meat Boy is for this video. Uh, as you can see, there's not maybe that much of a fancy cutscenes or anything like that. But uh, I would actually say that... Uh, wait, how does the controls work? Okay. <laughs> I'm not playing with my controller at the moment, so it feels a little bit weird. I, I don't know if this game has a controller support. I could actually... Well, it doesn't seem to be working. But yeah, uh, actually the game the gameplay itself seems to... Uh, seems to be... Most, mostly the same that is it in the Super Meat Boy version. And it even has these new tutorials, it seems. And this is really weird when you're playing with the <laughs> controller. And I have a feeling that my keyboard sounds are kind of picking up onto the, my microphone. So sorry if that happens too much. Man, this is actually... Okay, <laughs> I mean... It's, I'm used to playing the game with the controller. Oh my god, this feels absolutely horrible with the keyboard. I can't... I can't jump for the life of me, apparently. Oh my god, I'm way too used to... Used to the controller. But yeah, okay, now we actually have a sliding level, which is gonna cause me issues already. If this was on the controller, I swear this would be so much easier, but... My god. I mean this Oh these jumps aren't killing me. It's not easy fuck. <laughs> okay, okay. 
I'm getting the hang of it, maybe. Okay, no, yeah, 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 no problem. <laughs> to press the next five levels, okay. Well, I mean, I don't really need the tutorials, I don't think. Well, okay, maybe I need... I'm sure you should be able to just kind of... I don't know what's up with them. When you're gonna try to turn around to do jump. I think I've already had enough of this freaking meat boy prototype version. I I just uh, prefer the super meat boy version much more. Oh my oh my god. Oh no 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 Okay. Actually if I just take it slowly now Nope 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 I hate myself at the moment. My fucking god. I hate myself for putting myself through this shit. Oh yeah, fuck yeah. Let's check the next one. So this one is called Coil. I have no memory of this thing. But let's see what this was all about. Okay, so are you... Am I controlling this with the mouse? I think. So am I this... What the fuck am I? <laughs> I look like a sperm or something like that. I stop if I don't kind of wiggle away with the mouse, I think. <laughs> or something like that. Can I get in here? I actually, apparently I can. Oh, oh my god, did I just make a pregnancy happen or something? Okay. <laughs> okay. And now what? Do we just need to kind of... Should I try to kind of get them separated too? So that all the colors would be on their own? I mean now they're... Okay, so I just have to get them separated. That was really hard, but... Okay, what the hell are we now? Are we getting attacked? Do I need to kind of survive down? Downwards somehow? Yeah, I think I'm trying... They try to pull me up and I have to get downwards, I think. <laughs> what the hell? Okay, I think I got it. I don't really care about the text. Now what? Do I control this? Uh, maybe I have to kind of catch these. Yeah, like so. I think so. I don't know. This is this is a weird game. <laughs> okay, and now what? I never re I don't remember playing a game like this. What the actual fuck? Oh, I don't have to click it. Oh, okay. Well, that did something. What the hell now? Do I chase after the other one? No idea. Should I? Should I like? Um, am I catching it up? Yeah. Don't know. What's the point? Okay. And what now? Uh, how do I control this? I'm not sure at all. Now it just fell. Oh, what, what, was that it? Is this beginning again? Yeah, okay. All well, unsaved for what? What unsaved progress? I have, like, no, oh, no idea what the fuck was that all about anyhow. Okay, we're just gonna go on and move on to the next game now because that was just some weird ass shit. <laughs> I mean, like, literally. So weird. I don't even know if I wanna show that on the video. <laughs> okay, but next we have Triacnid or something like that. Let's just do the new game, I guess. There's some lore about spider. You can control balance with wasp keys. And I move it with the, my mouse, apparently. Okay, I think I remember this one. So you just kind of move, move around with this spider character. Gotta be careful, I guess, uh, about the rocks and stuff but yeah this guy can just basically climb like so uh i think this is the right way to go 
I'm not 100% sure, but yeah, I can. Well, this seems at least at least it's at least it's more intriguing than the previous one, but this one is not really that. Uh, I don't know what would be the word to describe it. It doesn't feel like it's too intriguing. Can I go to the water or do I die? Oh, I think I now took damage from the water because it's too deep. Maybe. Can I grab the wall? No, but I think I can use it too. No, I don't know if I can use it at all. I think I just have to go by pretty fast. So I won't drown. Something like that. Okay, now I don't. I think I did not take damage that time. Okay, this... Um, where's the challenge though? Because this is just kind of... I'm just walking, climbing around, but there doesn't seem to be much of a challenge to the game itself. Maybe because this is just uh, some early levels of the game. It doesn't actually have that much of a challenge put into it. Oh, there's some spikes here. Oh fuck, I died. <laughs> and it wants me to start over, I guess, yeah. Well, okay, I'm not gonna be bothered with that game too much. It didn't seem too interesting. Uh, I understand this is just a compilation of last games done by just a couple of guys, so I can understand that <coughs> some of them are not maybe that fantastic, and that's all okay. I'm just kind of here to check out them and still give my impressions about them, so uh, I'm still gonna judge them as a video game as they are, so I guess I'll choose the classic for this Aether game. Let's see what's this all about. This was to move in space and around planets. The ability to jump when on a planet. When latched to cloud, use was to swing. The cloud with the mouse to shoot your tongue at it. Okay. Oh, okay. So I'm on the Earth. I wonder though, can I? I think I should be able to depart from here somehow. Because it was talking about controlling the space. Maybe I can just... Okay. I was kind of trying to wondering... Ah, the clouds. Yeah, yeah. So I can actually... Like so. Yeah, I have to leave the... Earth, I guess, by <laughs> climbing the clouds or something like that. Oh, okay. I think I didn't get this last time I was playing the game many years back. I think I just got stuck because I didn't know how to leave the... Earth. No, wait, I can actually start remembering a little bit of this. A little bit of this space thing seems familiar. Like, woo, okay, I think I'm getting really low on gravity, so we can get much easier up here. Yeah, we can just kind of crap planets maybe i don't know it's showing me four different directions i'm just gonna head this way first to see what i could possibly find yeah i think i can find a planet that i can land on if i just go enough this way hopefully at least yeah it seems like there's gonna be something here okay gravida is there anything here oh there is something here. Ooh, can I get come back to the uh, where I came from? Back to the upper levels. Where did I fell down from here? Can't even remember anymore. I think I got stuck down here. How do I get back up? I don't know. I'm not 100% sure at all. I can actually. All right, I got already stuck with this game, but I uh, yeah, I guess you get the idea. It's just kind of adventuring in the space, finding planets, and try to solve some puzzles here. I guess I don't know. I think I'm just gonna <laughs> let that be. And what is this time? Time fuck? I've been waiting for you. I'm not sure. Arrow keys to move space bar. Arrow keys to move. Okay. <laughs> 
future self. Okay, this is gonna be some time travel shenanigans, I guess. Press A to change players. Oh, okay. I see. So I can climb here. Interesting. Well, this actually might be something interesting with the puzzles and such because uh, it has some puzzle action going. And then, uh, okay, easy business. Yeah, because you kind of have to use your brains to w when to switch and so on, I guess. Well, I mean, the early levels seems to be pretty easy, but I'm just gonna check this out a little bit. Oh, and that caused me to die. Pushing through seems to be the only answer. Oh, I can push it down, okay. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, then uh, I assume the goal is here. No, it's actually all the way up there, okay. Kind of interesting design of the game, I would say. And we just roll here, okay. Not bad. Any way for me to get the other one? I can, okay. Mm, I think I have to put that one there and... Can I... Yeah, I can put them like so. Ah, okay. Well, that actually also <laughs> required some brain brain action uh, maybe i'll get the key and then we just okay well that was pretty easy again hmm how about this one Got a kind of pile i guess is the word no wait can't i not pick this up okay well apparently i got stuck <laughs> i guess that's good mark to stop this game it's just I don't, don't want to waste too much in one game. Otherwise, it's gonna take forever with this video. Let's check out the spewer. Uh, I think I remember this one also. Yeah, move with this. Press out to reset. You can pause the game. How do I jump? Like so. Okay. So yeah, I think this was also this kind of a platformer. Yeah, because I think there was something to do with that goo thing that you can eat and puke goo maybe or something like that. If you hold the mouse, but uh, yeah, you can vomit. Yeah, to eat it back up and buy the space, then I just eat. Yeah, this is this kind of a vomit simulator thing or something like that. I don't know. Uh, yeah, if you need to jump higher, puke downwards as you jump. Yeah, this is some. <laughs> so I can just do that, and then I. <laughs> fly with my puke. Oh my god, this is these games are weird, man. No, I started it too late. Oh my god, okay, let's try again. Easy. Then I have to make my way back. Use the rest of the pu puke or whatever. <laughs> yeah, okay, this is pretty weird game, but oh no, how do Maybe can I, can I just swim through? If I just puke it... Can I just swim through it that without dying? No? Oh my god, okay. I already got stuck with this game. Well, fuck that. You got the idea about this game as well. I would say... Grey matter... Let me check that there. Comes the free life changing revelation. What the hell? Okay, what is this gray matter thing? Wait. What do I'm supposed to do? How do I destroy anything? There was no shoot button? What? Or do I just run straight at them? Okay. I think I still have to be careful about their ammo. Yeah, but I can just still mash them, I guess. Then I can pause the game whenever I want to. Take like shield, okay. Uh, is this just kind of a this ever looping game that you play as long as you leave? Once you die, then it's over and you have to start over. Yeah, I think so. Okay, okay. 
this would be also a little bit e easier to control with the controller. I would say it's not that uh, accurate when you're playing with the controller, I would say. Okay, I think we got the hang of this game. I'm just gonna keep it really short with some of these games. Uh, I think there's still one game left. Game mode for the 40 hour global game jam. What? Click the switch to make items appear. Click and drag items to move the item. It's like a whole furniture coming along. I don't know. Let's put that there and <laughs> the doll there, I guess. Mm, anything else? What the fuck? I'm gonna give up. I don't understand anything. Was made in 5 hours for 80 hours global game champ. Okay, and what is this? Little Edmund, the box, drawing a small box car. Okay, well I guess we got to see all the games. At least a little bit, I mean, I just couldn't find interest to get into any of these games. Uh, too much. Because I mean, yeah, I mean, I, I, as I said, I had no idea why I bought this basement collection on Steam back in the day. I really can't answer that question. It was a time when I I didn't have games on PC basically at all besides like Team Fortress 2 because it was free and I just had uh, mostly my games on console. And I had the Steam because of Team Fortress 2. Then I started kind of get into the what kind of other games are here on Steam and for some reason this is the first game that I have ever purchased. You know in the in the steam but yeah i guess we're gonna leave this video here i have nothing else to say about this game i just wanted to get back to it to see that what the hell is this and well i'm as impressed i was back in the day i think i think there is a good reason why i never returned to this game until today but yeah thank you guys for watching and leave a like if you enjoyed the video and if you want to see some other games, maybe from my Steam library or something like that, just leave a comment down below. If you could, I can make like a video that I could go through my Steam library. I don't have many games, but I have a couple. So if there is some that would interest the viewers here, I could make a video about that. But if you have thoughts like that in mind, leave a comment and Subscribe if you're new to here and as always I will see you guys with the future videos. So for now it's a bye bye.